Hi guys, welcome back. Now you can see we are in the Gila again, but I've done it how I used to have it when I was in Null Sec, where I used to do the, um, I used to do the anomalies or or even doing take an officer on. Um, but that was two ships really, the Tango and the Gila. Anita was in the Gila, Fozzie was, uh, Anita was in the Tango, Fozzie was in the Gila. Anyway, I'll give you, I'll give you a quick look at the, um, the fit. It's, it's pure drones. So you've got 548 DPS and that is all drones. Everything on the ship is either drone damage, drone distance or drone speed. Uh, look, if you look at the computer there, uh, that's the 30% maximum velocity bonus. <laughs> Obviously, the more you put on, you're going to be penalised. So you've got the three there, like it says there, dimension returns. So on three, you're not going to be getting 90%. You're going to be getting whatever it is. I can't remember now. Uh, I had a list somewhere, but... Um, it's still worth it with three, four, maybe not. These, yeah. If you look, uh, if you look, if you simulate this, I've got a targeting range of 185 kilometers and the drone range of 140. So that is, that's quite manageable. It keeps you at distance because you have no tank whatsoever. So you are relying on getting out to where you need to be and then orbiting at a speed and just watching whatever gets close, <laughs> trying to kill it before it gets to you. So, um, let's give it a go. Let's see, Well, I'll say let's give it a go. Let's see. Let's see where we are with, with the missions first. Damsel in distress. Uh, okay, we'll give it a go. It's quite a toughish one. We'll see how we go. We'll see how we go. If, if I have to call it, I'll call it. But let's, let's see how we go. It's in Umoka, so we don't need to go far. We need to pick the damsel up. I think she automatically ends up in your in your cargo hold when you blow up the um, pleasure domes. So let's have a look. I've got... Uh, Plenty of room in the cargo hold, yep. Plenty of room, it's got some nanite repair paste. I might actually put a little bit more in there. Oh. Have I got some? Have I got some? Sure I have somewhere. Maybe not. <laughs> hmm. It's usually up here. Let's have a look. Right, I don't think I've got any. Okay, let me just quickly see if there's any on the market. There might be some here. No, there's some in... There's some in Kakakilla. Not much. I'll buy the 200, 205. I'll go and collect it later on. Okay, I mean, that should do us 134, unless we're in dire straits. Anyway, let's undock. Let's see what, what it brings us. So this is Damsel in Distress. I should have put that on the title, to be honest. I will do on the edited version. So let's have a quick look again. 185, 140, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. So I need to burn away as quickly as possible to, a, to at least 130. So I might have to overheat uh, the afterburner. 
top speed of that is only 753 of course lights will travel a bit faster and of course I can drop drones as soon as I'm there and get them to deal with those as I'm burning away it's just going to be a bit of bit of both there we are so let's let's carry on past I'll drop my drones Kaldari Navy Vespers I'll drop my drones get these locked up quickly we're going to overheat this I think Right, get the drones on them. Okay, let's get those quickly sorted. Um, if they get near me, I'm screwed. The um, the big the big boys. If they get near me, yeah, I'm doomed. So I'm just going to quickly just bring some of these down. I need to take that off now. I'll repair these while I can. Okay. We're getting there. Once we're out there, we can uh, we can orbit. Let's pop crawl. And then come more big boys. Okay, so they are drawing, the drones are drawing damage. They're drawing all the aggro, to be honest, on the, especially on the new lot I've just spawned. So you need to keep your eye on your drones. One is getting a bit of damage, any shield damage. But you do need to keep your eye on that. Uh, he's, just, uh, he's just got a good hit there. You need to keep them. You need to keep your drones busy. Keep them moving. Don't let them stop. That's when they get hit. I do, they do go fast. My God, they do go fast. Right, we are going to orbit at this distance. <laughs> These Macarials aren't living long. That drone is shaking off the damage. That's good. So these are going to be constantly coming out to me, so I've got to watch the distances. That'll be the next one to go. <laughs> okay. No, I've got to put it on that one. So as you can see, I'm orbiting at about 100. We'll get we'll get this uh, Macarial 85 killed. I think, excuse me, I'm very uh, nasally today, guys. Okay, as you can see, they die pretty damn quickly. Good damage. It's good damage from two drones, two medium drones. I mean, really, from two mediums. Look at the damage: eight twenty-five, six nineteen, one thousand nine hundred eighty-three. Holy crap! <laughs> it's good stuff, and they're not lasting long. And he's definitely not lasting long. He's gone already. There's another spawn as well uh, to come. And then I can put the drones on the uh, pleasure dome. There are a few more spawns, I think. 
been a while since I did this one. So if you just keep killing stuff, just keep killing stuff that's uh, closest. Good, they've already gone to that. I'll just reaffirm that. So I've got all the aggro, and of course they're going to be missing me. So it gives my uh, little drones time to get on the ships, not take any aggro, but when a new spawn comes in, it will aggro the drones. Okay, on that one, boys. You can't imagine medium drones doing this sort of damage, guys. It's crazy. I mean, look at how they ripped through a Macario. Wow. That's what always blew me away about Gila's and their and their uh, their bonuses to drones. Now I'll put you guys on that one. And the bonuses to drones, five hundred percent. Two is, is it on the damage and three hundred or two hundred, three hundred on uh, speed? Look at the speed of them. So especially with the carriers, they're not going to hit them at, while they're orbiting at those sort of speeds. They're too fast. The only things that can do damage to the drones are mediums and lights. And that's only if the drones are not uh, are not doing what they should and be and stood still. You just have to constantly I mean watch the speed of these now. Look at that. Crazy. <laughs> Gotta love it. Just watch how quick they rip through their armor. Well, they actually go into the uh, structure before the armor's through. Well, they did on the last one. There, look, into structure, and armor's not complete yet. Just look at that. Bad boys. Okay, so we will, we will lock a pleasure down. Pleasure Garden, should I say? And we'll sick him on him. Go on, boys, kill that Pleasure Garden. And that one is worth slave pens, I think, as well. Anyway, we'll just kill him. I'll turn this off. There will be another spawn. Uh, let's repair her. Let's repair that. Oh, have I run out of. Oh, it's 119. It's repping. <laughs> okay, where's my local up there? What's happening to the overviews? That's the one they need to get very quickly. Need to put them on the spider. Oh, they've caught up to him. Oh, bloody hell. And that is fast. I think he's got away now. He'll slow down when he get There he goes, he's dead. That's cool. Okay, let's uh, send him back. Have a bit of fun with the mediums. With the cruisers. There's another one. Nope. Oh, I'll let them finish him off first. They can come for him then. Right. 
so far out I don't need to worry too much uh, my sig signature radius will be pretty small as well because I've nothing on if it was a micro drive I would be like the size of a small planet but okay let's send those back now let's lock up some of the cruisers the gilas Right, we'll set them on this one. <coughs> so as you can see, I've got a little bit of aggro, but the drones... No, oh no, I've got it all. Got it all. That's good. That's fine. <laughs> So the drones are not getting any attention at all, which is how I like it. Now we're just left with Macarios and the slave pen and the pleasure gun. Need to hit that one at 89. It's closest. You can hear the drones. Look at the damage there, just all of a sudden, boom. All over. He's dead, he just doesn't know it yet. Bye bye. Yep, nice one, the boys are on that one already. I think I'm out of range of their missiles. Might just be coming into range, actually. So just the two left. I love watching the damage. Because where they where they hit, it damages the ship. the last one I won't have any kill marks on this one I think I had 10 on my when I was in null sec oh, you have it on the wing here I had 10 kill marks on there before I lost it. Damn. Or not Anita, it was fuzzy. Come on. We need the damsel. And of course, salvaging all these wrecks would be quite beneficial. <laughs> it's not something I really want to do right now I used to while I'm recording I'm not going to do it because it means messing about switching between screens it's not going to happen <laughs> so we've got slave pen slave pen Leisure Gardens. There's plenty of slave pens. There we are, look. Oh. 
they need to get the lights. Right, my little ones, you need to get those. I've got the aggro, so that's good. There you go, that's one. Two. Ouch! A little bugger. That's Zor. It'll be Zor. Yeah, it's Zor who's hitting me. It's okay. I'll have him. Uh, I'll have him pop now. <laughs> He's gonna hurt. We'll get him put down. <laughs> That's thermal as well. I think he's going to die before I do, guys. He's, he's, I mean, it's only worth half a million. It's crazy. He does sometimes drop a decent... Um, he drops an implant, a hardwired, but it's normally a crappy one that's worth nothing, really. But he does drop one sometimes that's worth millions. So I will be going to his wreck. finish these off yeah I forgot about Zor I love the cinnables I've said it before I do love the cinnable the way it looks, it's pure evil. Pure evil. I know it's a cruiser, but brilliant. And the last one. Right, they can go back to the pressure gardens. check my uh, cargo and there she is so I can call them back now they were damaged by it exploding but there's not much damage a big bang and they're now tucked up in bed so we can go back to Warp drive active. our uh, agent So tell me what you think about that, guys. Uh, the Keeler and just using two medium drones. Uh, they're faction, uh, they're faction joint drones, but and they do take a, a hell of a beat in faction drones compared to normal ones. So if you can afford them, use them. They're not a huge amount. They're only about two point seven million, something like like that. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Excellent. Shall we request another one? The score. We should be able to do that as well. Now that looks like it's Sancha. And it's in a mocker. Okay, we'll give it a try. We'll give it a try. Let's accept it. Let me just repair. I don't think it's that much. Yeah, there's only that to repair. It's fine. 
Okay, let's undock. So the score, see I don't, with me using the drones, and I only use those drones, he says, tell you what, let's have a look at the mission report. The score, and it's Sancha. Let's have a look, because I've got other drones I can use. The score, and it's Sancha Nation, level four. EM and thermal, of course. All oh, right, there's no scrammers. Okay. EM and thermal, that's fine. Right, let's go to it, let's do it. Oh. What drones have I got? I've got uh, EM and Thermal, so I have Infiltrators, I think, are th Thermal. Let's have a look. No, sorry, EM. Yep, yeah, that's good. Okay, so we'll use the Imperial Navy Infiltrators. Again, the faction, so they're uh, plenty of damage. I see how we do with those. Sometimes it always doesn't work that way, even though it should do. And you find out that Caldari and Navy Vespers are the better option, but anyway, we'll find out. Just watch the damage off, off your drones. Compare it to, uh, to what were you getting with the uh, Vespers. Just thinking if I've have I got some thermal ones? Hammerheads. I think hammerheads that oh no 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 Did I just launch them? You muppet. No I didn't. Thought I'd flipping launched them then. And they are uh kinetic. No, they're eight. They're thermal. Okay. So I've got the hammerheads. Instead of the infiltrators, we'll see. Only got two hammerheads, so. Okay. So let's drop the infiltrators. And let's see. Blimey. Let's see how we do. We gotta burn away. Pretty damn quick. And it looks like my boys are taking all the aggro. So we gotta work through these quick. Keep them on the move. Keep locking targets. You notice one of them's got a lot of damage on it now. Ooh, I might, I might lose that. Oof. Some armor damage on him there. Don't like to see that lot. A lot of damage. <clears throat> so they're going pretty quick. Again, he's getting damaged. You get rid of these lights. We should be. Should be all right. Oops. My fault that. Right. I'm gonna now orbit that gate at what I am. Six eighty four. So all the lights have gone. But I am getting damage, or the drones are getting damage off the mediums. So we need to rip through these as quick as pos. See the other uh, infiltrators getting damaged now. Come on, boys.
That's good. We're nearly there. Hey, Phantasm, spiky butt plug. Can't say uh, Sancho ships excite me. Okay, we're down to the last few now and we should be good. I won't head for the gate yet, just in case there is a spawn. And you're a respawn. And that's... that's a, a nightmare. This one's a nightmare, big boy. But watch how quick he goes down. He's not hitting me at all. Some damage there, plenty of damage there. Again, he's into structure. He's doomed. Right, I'm gonna make my way in. Make my way to the gate. Let's get the boys in. One too painful. Right, the second group. There's no aggro warping on the second group either, guys. So they will. If. Oh, okay. Okay. Group one and two, we can aggro them, but if you attack group three before the others, it will aggro all of them. There we go. Okay, I'm just going to burn away. So there won't be any aggro. Group one, two destroyers, four sentinels, and two back cruisers. That's this is group one. Okay, so I'm gonna lock them all up if I can, and send my boys out. We'll take them group by group. This is, oops, this is group two, and this is group three. 
So if we play if we play it right, we should aggro only the group we're attacking, and therefore limit damage to to the gila and limit damage, of course, to the to the drones. I'm going to open the gate at 110. <clears throat> Sweet. So there's no spawns. There's just these. So once we kill these, we can go through the gate. Come on, boys. So th these are all locked up now. So a bit of shield damage. A lot of shield damage on one of the infiltrators. Looks like he's... Re he's... Um, Regenning, but you do need to keep your drones on the move. Sweet. So I'm going to lock up this group. So when he's down, okay, sending him over to that second, second group now. <clears throat> so phantasm again. Okay, next one. Right, I'm going to lock them up anyway because they have been aggroed. Or oh, they're aggroing my drones. I'd rather. They usually. They do split up sometimes. I'd rather have them focus uh, on one. Sweet. You can see how quickly they're, they're dying. So the big boys are hitting the drone. Or well, one of my drones. Let's get rid of this uh, mutant lord. I'll show you now. Okay. We'll get rid of that one. <laughs> they won't budge. Little swines. Ooh. You be careful, you might you might damage my ship. They are using ultraviolet laser crystals, which is yeah medium range. For I suppose for a uh, nightmare is. Okay, next. Boom. I'm getting a tiny bit of damage. I think I can resist that much damage. 20, was it? 26? Yeah. Okay. 
Ouch. That's got to hurt. <laughs> He's trying to hit my drones with ultraviolet lasers. They must be, what, 3,000 off him? The best he could hope to use is, is um, um, what is it? Oh my god. The, the clear ones, I can't remember what you call them now, my god. It's been a long time. Multi, whatever it is. There you go, he's dead. One more. Yeah, the close-up crystals. Jesus. The brain's going, I can't remember what they are now. It'll come to me. <laughs> Ooh, San Sanchez Nation don't like me anymore. I'm going to burn towards the gate. These are uh, marauders. Nightmares. Okay. And they're uh, coming back to the uh, drone bay. Okay, so we've three battleships and that's it. Sorry, no we haven't. We've got three frigates, one destroyer in group one. Right, so again I'm going to go back on myself. I'll get these locked up. We'll drop the infiltrators. And send them out, do their stuff. There's no gate now, so because this is the last room, so I will just orbit that rock. <clears throat> okay, come on, boys, rip them apart, which they are doing. Oh boy, insta popping them. I'm going to orbit now. 73. Okay. Actually, I'll orbit that. So there's two. Two but two battleships. Yep. And this is it, really, guys. <clears throat> These phantasms will die pretty quickly. Last one of this group. He's trying to hit the drones, but he's dead. So now just the two battleships, and uh, that'll be game over. I 
Have they done something with the nightmare? It doesn't look as spiky. Or is it the skin? Have they done something with the skin? Maybe. Ooh, look at the damage on him. Doesn't know where it I think he's hit hit the rock. He's doomed. <coughs> there you go. And we're on to the last one. Okay, so the last one. Trying desperately to uh, to hit the gila. Don't think the missile. Oh, he's hit me for twenty odd. Ooh. There we go, halfway through st uh, structure. And he's gone. Call the boys back. Look how fast they are. Pew. They're back already. So that should say. The score object is complete. Okay. Let's go. Warp drive active. So, two missions there, guys. Are, uh, I'd say they were medium. But you can see the advantage of staying out the way with the ship and sending in the drones, but you got to keep your eye on the drones and keep them moving. Or else they will die if they stood still. So always, as soon as they killed one, get them onto the next one, so they're, they're buzzing around that. Let me know if you want a, this setup, guys. I, I'll put it in... Uh, if you just give me a, a comment in the uh, in comments, and I'll uh, I'll put the fit underneath that. I'll reply to you. Put the fit in. But that's a pretty decent fit. It's not an expensive fit. It is only five hundred and forty-seven million. Not expensive at all. And we completed that, and we have 580,000 Kaldari Navy loyalty points. I'm 20,000 away from a Kaldari Navy uh, Raven. Excellent. Okay, thank you very much for watching, guys. Um, I do appreciate you watching and liking and subscribing. It does help the channel a lot. Uh, I'll be back on again either late tonight or tomorrow morning and we'll do some more level fours probably maybe in the tengu or in the domi or maybe in the, even in the raven depends what we get okay guys thanks a lot and i'll see you next time take care bye bye